Sup, what is up everyone? What are you looking at? Bitch. Uh, yeah, so welcome back guys. We are back on uh, Mafia 3. We're gonna continue with the main stories guys. So right now we're gonna wait for another person. And we're gonna talk about the... Uh, to take down the another... like... Uh, another town. <sighs> This part of town's run by a man named Tony D'Orazio. From what I was able to piece together, he's a real fucking weirdo. Some kind of savant when it comes to numbers. Then he must be the one who runs Lou Marcano's books. Runs his books, launders his money. Hell, he even manages lose relationships with city officials. It's Tony's job to make sure their asses stay greased. How do I get to him? Well, that's where things get interesting. Tony lives in the penthouse on the top floor of the Royal Hotel. Elevator access is restricted, and the rest of the hotel is crawling with Tony's goons. Well, he can't stay up there all the time. I'm gonna need a schedule for when he comes and goes. I've been watching this cocksucker for a month now, and he's left exactly one time. That was because one of his men fucked up. Took a pipe to the poor bastard's left arm. Well, it looks like he's got a front business he uses to issue bribes and launder lose money. And another one that soaks up funds from the city. I hit him. He overreacts. Then I get my opening. And fuck up things between him and Lou in the process. Be careful with this one. Just because Tony's a goddamn spastic doesn't mean he won't cut your balls off if given the chance. Really? I have a subscription. <laughs> what are you looking at, huh? What I it? <laughs> that was pretty funny. Let's do this, baby. Okay, so we're gonna go speak to this guy first. Where's my car? Is that my car over there? Yeah. Oh. Jesus! Repent. information for me the name's Lenny Davis I work in the city clerk's office and your friend said you could help with this guy blackmailing me what kind of juice makes you someone worth blackmailing my office approves new projects under development I, I fucked up cheated on my wife and this guy Jimmy Kavar filmed it come to find out the girl worked for Kavar too and now he owns you he's forcing me to rubber stamp phony building projects and cash the checks for his company Kavar construction probably seen the signs of a way to building the new city hall. Thing is, Kaval doesn't really come around unless there's a problem. Don't worry. I'm pretty good at causing people problems. Some of his men hang out around downtown. Look, I ain't a bad guy. I, I just made a mistake is all. Keep your head down, Lenny. I'll pay Kaval's men a visit. See what they know. People will know more about what he's doing than I will. Met my fellow right. doing Mardi Gras, just That's like what a have I got myself mermaid. into? Me, not him. Okay. Okay, so we've got some, uh, some uh, side missions to do. Uh, I'm going to go straight away speak to this guy, and after that I'm just going to do the my side God. mission offline. I mean, not offline, off camera, sorry, why am I saying offline? I'm going to do it off, uh, off camera because uh, uh, I want to do the main missions for you guys, so don't worry about it, guys. I'm, 
we're definitely going to see the main uh, death today, probably. If not, then the on the next episode. But I want to do it today, that's why I want to do this one. And uh, the rest of the side missions uh, off camera, guys. So, so yeah, uh, we're not being. I like this gun, man, this gun is pretty freaking fast, you know. We've got four grenades, we've got one medkit, we've got 4k inside my wallet, and we've got 44k inside my safe. You the reporter? Harold Colley. It's Hatler. I'm covering Durazio's little corruption racket. Can't imagine it's good for your health, naming names in the Marcano organization. Didn't you hear? Even cigarette smoke will kill you. So here's what I know. We've got city officials taking bribes. Blackmail. Juicy stuff. At the center of it all is a fellow named Frankie Bernard. The problem is, I don't know where he operates. Might make it kind of hard to find him. Ah, but the thing is, I hear Mr. Bernard uses dead drops. Spots where his people leave bribes for officials to pick up. And I just happen to know where they are. I also understand Frankie keeps a sweet blackmail stash of every dirty deal he's done. I'll see if I can't get one of those couriers to give up the location for your mystery man. And his little blackmail stash. Working for Bernardo just to see... Alright guys, is. so I'll you be right back. I will do all the side missions. Uh, and when I finish them all, I'll come back to you guys. Do them on camera because they might be the big ones. So, uh, and that's when we're gonna see like a little uh, red car. We're gonna have to follow that car, and oh, there it is. So we're gonna have to follow it, and this 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 car will take us somewhere. And when it does, uh, we'll be able to have an extra mission. So. Kill this guy's here. I'm just hoping something happens. I don't have anything to do with those. Yeah, so good to see you again, Count. <laughs> <laughs> I can have to kill him! 
He's down. You fucking pieces of shit are dead! Dead, you hear me? I'll tell you fucking die out! And I'm never gonna find you! I fucking vouch for you and Mr. Kavar, both of you pricks! Ciao, dude. You didn't think we'd find out? <laughs> this guy's gonna kill him and I'm just like, nothing happens. Like, we are done here already. I'm taking all his money already, these guys, you know? I'm going in the car. I'm on foot in downtown, innit? Uh, and the next one will be, the last one will be, 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 be over there. And then we are done. Oh no, lad. Just getting her warmed up. Come on, get out. Get out! Thank you for the wheels and an engine. Appreciate it. Thank you very much. Let's go. Come on, let's see what I I'm out here and I'm gonna go and get another guy. I mean, I'm not pushing through. I already followed one, so I don't need to follow another one. Okay. Disco is fast. I think this car right now that we have it right now in here. Uh, in my opinion, I think it's the fastest car. Mm -hmm. Great road. Kiss my white ass. Why would I? I'm black. I think this one you could be from here. Watch it. Hey now. Somebody is having sex on the top of me or what? I'm just swimming, just don't mind me. There's way too many of these guys, man. So sick and protected, oh shit. You getting it? Ask me that shit one more time. You see me using the camera. Something ain't right about this. The motherfucker. <laughs> God, <laughs> fuckers, no lie. Who screams for that so long? This. If he plays ball with Mr. Jarrazio, she won't. Shit, that ain't. He's got any sense, that is. Okay. Well, and I should probably right stay put. Is this guy having an orgasm? Yeah. Like or is he having just a massage? This here's off limits. He's got a gun! He's got a gun. I don't. Am I crazy or is that? Is that Please be more careful. Gone, whoever it was. I got pretty lucky over here. Would you watch it, please? That son of a bitch has a gun! Let's try over here now. There we go, come in, come in, come in, come in. What's your problem? I don't have any problem. That can't be good. Trust me, it isn't. Because you're gonna go down. To the left. This guy's are like walking next to me, he's like, what's going on? So we'll leave this guy over there. Can I get him there? Looks like fun. Who wants to come with me and check that out? Oh, I've never seen a dead body before. Is this guy actually having sex with a guy? Yo, that is disgusting, dude. I'm out Something of here, bro. Gay bastard. Sorry about that. Is that boy carrying? Coming through. This person's dead. Come on. Get 
stuff for me. Hey, brother. Look out! Ah. Look where you're going, oh, for Christ's God, sake. Mate. Sorry, guys. You know you want it. Let's just get out from here and go speak to the main guy. Oh shit, why are you sleeping, dude? You're supposed to be waking, man. Ah, oh, forgot, sorry, I killed you. Thank you so much, okay, so... We're gonna go speak to this guy first. Alright guys, uh, we are back. Uh, I have talked to both of them. They give Both of them give me a uh, mission, so... One is over here, one is over there. So first of all, we're going to take the closest one, so the red one. And then we're going to do the pink one. So after that, guys, uh, if we have enough time, we would be able to uh, do the main like main mission. If not, then we're going to have to wait for the next episode, guys. I want to do the next mission straight away, guys, so it's faster for both of us. But we will see, guys, we will see. So we'll see how much time we're going to have left. So we over here is my fifth one, so let's get, get cracking. Yeah, well, you know, guys, uh, I understand where you guys are. Alright, guys, we're here. Need to light up a target downtown. Help me out. They're coming, yes, they're coming. Guys, we are here. Okay, flash we we'll get rid of the cops. I should use this cop to more cars. guy and he's the last one so we're gonna kill him and we're gonna skip to the next person D is gonna bury me. You hear? Bury me. Well, you're worried about the wrong this. man, Jimmy. There we go. So, how the hell? Secure it. Nice. Okay, we've done this. Oh, there's some more money over there, man. Okay, assign. Send whoever you got downtown. We gotta secure it while we can. Certainly. I'll send them immediately. Thank you very much. Okay, let's go. We're gonna go for the next one, guys, now, and 
we're gonna see what we are. Thank you for the backup. Damn, man, we are army. Why had I become a priest? Every bad thing you experience, every trauma, they, they never leave you. Sure, you might forget about them for a while, but when the next one comes along, no matter how slight, it brings everything back. It reminds you of the Wait, you been lugging around. I knew I couldn't carry all that on my own. Damn, emotional that was, man. Damn, you guys. We're gonna lose a whole fucking day over this. You know that, don't you? Yeah, so, it is not my fault. That plan said 14 feet, inches. That wall was, that wall was supposed to start 14 inches back. Inches back. I'm on foot in downtown and need some new wheels. Then this guy got stuck in traffic. Oh, they blocked him like serious? That was actually pretty sick. Be quiet, or else you all die. Ciao, mate. You guys are gonna see me, okay? That's cool. Okay, I'm just walking in. I am just walking through and I'm just killing this guy's like I'm some certain ninja, I'm telling you all. Oh money. Thank you. Extra five hundred dollars. Will look good to my pocket. Like this guy doesn't even know that I'm in here. Ciao ciao mate, wait, let me just get the money quickly. 3k and boom. So what? You gonna kill me now? Yep. Good idea. Actually, I will. He's the boss, not me, so. Extra 1500 to my pocket, thank you so much. Damn, th I think this one was way easier than the other one. I'm downtown. Need some help securing it. And that has us securing the entire district. You know talent when you see it, I'll give you that. Damn, guys, we did it. We did it all, all together. So we will not have enough time to uh, make the last strike for the last man. But I promise you guys, on the next episode, it will be worth of doing it. So... I will do the next episode 
uh, with getting the last main mission on the side. So uh, when we do this one, guys, it will be it will be full episode about it. So guys, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you soon on the next episode of the Mafia. Thank you so much, and subscribe.